I'm gonna tell you everything you need to know to get the most out of Kartra's super powerful interactive video features. Hi everyone, it's Kevin from Solopreneur, and today I wanna to talk to you about Kartra Video. The video features in Kartra are probably my favorite features of the entire tool. Everyone knows that video is super hot and the engagement rates for video far surpass everything else that's out there. You can really create a connection with video that you just can't do with any other format. And Kartra's video features are amazing. And what makes them so great is that they're integrated with all of the other tools. So in this video, we're gonna go over everything. I'm gonna show you how to create videos, how to upload them, how to brand them. And I'm also gonna show you guys some really cool advanced automations you can do with the video and some other features. So from our dashboard, we just go to my videos to access the videos area. So here you can see all of the videos you've already uploaded, along with any campaign specific videos that the template builder has already put in there. Now to add a new video, just go to plus video. Then you can do a multiple video upload if you'd like, or you can do a single video. I'm just gonna do a single video for simplicity's sake. You can call it test video. And then what you wanna do is you wanna obviously choose a category. In this case, I'm just gonna go no category. And you can manage your categories here as well if you want. Then you go to create. So once we're in here, we just need to choose the video we want to upload. I'm just gonna go in here and just pick any old video um, just for now, right? A three minute video here. And so it's gonna take a few minutes here and it's going to start uploading it. Okay, so once you've uploaded a video, there are quite a few things that you can do. So under display settings, you can have it that it's like a pop-up or you can have it that it's embedded. I always use embedded. Again, you can fix the width and height and whatnot, but the responsive, what that'll do is make sure that your video always works with the parameters within your website so it nicely adjusts. I'd always leave it on this. Settings, so now a splash image means that you can kind of have like a custom thumbnail and watermark is if you wanna have like a watermark, of course, like overlay in uh, your video so I can show you what that looks like as well. If you'd like, let's just say we grab this right here. We just upload it and now we can see that there's a watermark there. And over here, you can actually have some branding here so you can have it match. So Solopreneur is the primary color is yellow. So I've made it yellow here. So it makes your videos a little bit more on brand. You can show the controls if you want to allow that, if you want to allow people to skip ahead. But if you want a video where you really want them engaged and you want them to watch it sequentially, then you might want to turn that off. Likewise, you can have it auto load on play. It doesn't work on every browser. Some browsers actually stop auto load. You can have a share button if you want uh, this content to actually be shareable and then it'll add a social share icon now that is good for content that is not gated but if you actually gate it then you might not want that and likewise you can have an overlay here so just a few options here and next probably the most important is the call to action this is what makes Kartra is so much more powerful than anything like YouTube or anything like that. So firstly, you can have opt-in forms. That's right. So you can actually have a lead capture form right from within your video. So you can have it start at a certain time. You can type a headline. You can you know set up whatever form you want. And you can have it such that the video will be paused and they can opt in and continue, but they'll be able to close it or you can have it that it's mandatory for you to be able to watch the rest of the video. So let's say you want a video where they can only watch the first minute until they sign up, then you could do that. So they watch a bit of the video, you kind of tease them, and then in order to continue watching, you can get their email address. So this is a great lead capture mechanism. The next is image banner. So this is almost like a banner ad you can have within your video. So again, you can set it when it starts, you can upload something and the video will be paused while the image is there and then you can actually link that out so you can pause the video have a link to that right within your video whatever your special offer is full screen and then hey guys limited time offer pause the video there's this huge thing you can click out of it so super powerful next caption likewise you can have a message that displays here and you can link to that as well again you can have you know that display for a certain time period only 
Caption plus button, same thing, except now it also has a button to make it a little bit more prominent to call to action. The next one's actually pretty cool. It's called Social Unlock, where you can have it such that in order to finish watching the video or to continue, they need to share it on Facebook or Twitter. And again, there's this option here where you can kind of suggest it, but they can close it. But if you check this, then they actually have to do it in order to continue. For simplicity's sake, why don't we do actually the opt-in? Let's just do that one. Let's just say we say this, this is it, and then we go create now. And then what we can do is we can actually see that preview. And we've set it at zero seconds, so in order for them to watch it, they need to fill it in. And the next thing you can do is you can actually tag your leads. Just the lead capture and interactive video components of Kartra alone make it something as comparable to Vistia or Vimeo but this takes it to a whole nother level. So with Kartra tags, you can actually tag people when they do certain things. So let's just say you wanna tag them when they visit the videos page, or you wanna tag them when they get to a certain point in the video, or when they actually interact with one of the call to actions. You can actually create a tag. So let me just talk to practically what this means. You could have it such that you create a tag for someone when they watch half the video or that they've clicked the call to action. So let's just do this. Let's just say if someone has watched at least 30 seconds of this video, uh, and we're gonna call this, uh, let's create a new tag, right? Let's just call this example tag. This for now, right? Example video tag. Uh, and then we create this tag. Um, right here, no category, just an example. And now when people watch at least 30 seconds of this video, they are tagged with that. And actually I'll just show you this last thing. At the end of the video, you can have it automatically loop. You can have it play another video or you can send it to the offer in the video. So if someone is so engaged that they haven't even clicked anything, you can still send them at the end. But let's just end the video for this example. So now we've set up that video and just keep in mind, we set up that example tag. So now that we've set up that tag, I'm going to show you just two of the smallest things you can do with those tags. Honestly, guys, the potential is limitless, the kinds of things you can do. But let's just say you wanna create some emails. You can go and you can go to tag here. You can go and you can actually create emails that dispatch to only people who watched half your video. Could you see the power in that, right? Like you could have a different drip for, let's say someone who watched 30 seconds. Hey, notice you abandoned the video, watch the remaining, if you wanted to do that as an example. Or you could do like um, someone who watched the whole video but didn't take action, you could maybe upsell them with a special offer. So that's the trigger point and then you can obviously send them an email and create an email. So that's just one example, one thing you could do. Let me show you another thing you could do. Let's just say this is your product page and you're selling this, but you wanna give a bonus offer to people who watch that particular video or who didn't watch that video. So let's just say, I'm just gonna pick something as an example. Let's just say in here you have a call to action. This is your uh, bonus offer. Let's just drag it in here. Let's just say this is like your special offer. now. Don't worry about the design, I'm just showing you quickly. But let's say this offer, what you do is you go in here and you can actually set this up to only show to people who have subscribed to a tag or someone who has not subscribed to a tag. So you can see the power here. So we can have it so that only people who saw at least 30 seconds of that very particular video now get access to this. That's just an example of what you can do with video plus all the other features. And that's really the power of Kartra where everything is integrated together. You can do some ninja level marketing that's very personalized to the specific journey that your customer is having. Just want to show you really quickly some of the awesome things you can do with video and I'm just scratching the surface with what I showed you. If you haven't tried Kartra yet, click the link in the description. You can get a 14 day trial for just $1. And if you found this video helpful, drop me a like. I really appreciate it. it. Motivates me to keep making great content like this for you. If you want more sales and marketing automation content, subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.